a site on the dark web where you can buy aliens. Ow, what the f It stung me. My skin is peeling off. Disclaimer, this video is a skit for entertainment purposes only. Do not attempt to recreate these acts. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. As you can tell by the title, I'll be continuing my exploration of the dark web in today's video. I despise long intros, so I'm not gonna make a super long intro, but if you guys do enjoy this video, please subscribe to my channel and give it a thumbs up because my analytics show that most of the people that watch my videos are not subscribed. So apparently there's a site on the dark web where you can buy aliens extraterrestrials and obviously I wouldn't have content if I didn't buy things from the dark web so let me show you this site I'm gonna have to blur some of it out obviously because I don't want anyone going on this site the dark web can be dangerous so stay away you guys but aliens for sale and this is the first one that they have And they have this one. Wow. They have this one. This one looks like a frog to me. Then there's this one. There's this one right here. Oh my gosh. Wait, does that one have two heads? That one kind of looks like it has two heads. Whoa. That one's a little too weird for my taste. Okay, so I couldn't figure out which alien to purchase, so I did tic-tac-toe, and this is the one that came up right here. I just got an order confirmation. Order confirmation, Annabelle, your order for alien number XX0462 will arrive within 48 hours. So it'll be arriving in the next couple of days. I'm excited. I guess I'll continue the video once it gets here. So it's two nights later and my package just arrived. So let me unbox this for you. This alien baby was found on one of the ships that crashed back in the war of 1996. It was held at Area 51 for years until someone smuggled it out during the Storm Area 51 raid, September 20th, 2019. Wow. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna open the jar and hold it. They didn't specify on the website if it was alive or not, but it looks kind of dead. So, you can like see its veins. See that? God, it's so slimy. It's pretty wet from the solution that it was sitting in in this jar. I don't know what this solution is, but some of it dripped on my pen. Ow, what the f
It stung me. It looks really bad. Oh my gosh, it looks really bad. I think I need to be admitted to the infectious disease unit or something. It looks like my skin is starting to peel. It looks like it's it could be a burn or something, like a chemical burn. But it's like, if I went to the hospital, what would I tell them? You know what I mean? That I bought an alien off of the dark web and it stung me and now I have like some infectious disease. I don't know how legal it is for me to buy stuff from the dark web, but I'm pretty sure if I went to the hospital and they found out that I bought something from the dark web, I would get in trouble and I don't want that to happen. I need my record to stay clean, so I'm just going to wrap it up, ice it maybe, and hopefully it gets better by tomorrow, but I'll keep you guys updated. Update, I just woke up from a nap and it got way worse. It itches really bad. My skin is peeling off. I've been googling what this could be and I think I actually might have found some answers. Alien bacteria discovered above. Alien bacteria. Alien bacteria in space. The alien bacteria found have absolutely no resemblance to anything on this planet. Scientists discovered four strains of alien bacteria found in space and they are brand new discoveries. 